Today's video is going to be a little bit on the different side. I had a request from one of my viewers for some help on installing an app. He specifically asked if I could install Fox News. Me being the equal opportunity YouTuber that I am, I will also include CNN News. So you can pick which one you want or you can install both of them if you'd like. At the very least, mash that like button because it helps my videos to do much better on the YouTube platform. All right then, so here we go. We'll start from left to right, we'll start with CNN, and then we'll end with Fox News. All right, I'm going to switch to a on-screen capture app that I have. If you're not sure how to get to privilege mode, no need to pray like this gentleman. Just look up there and I'll have instructions on how to get to privilege mode. If you're already configured for privilege mode, just swipe up, click on the circle, you'll get to this Android desktop, Hit the circle with the six dots and you're here. So from here, first thing we'll do is we'll click on the browser. And then from Google, let's go ahead and search for APK Mirror. Once we go to APK Mirror, we will be looking for two APK files. One for CNN and then one for Fox News. Make certain that you do not download anything that says CNN for Android TV. You just want the CNN breaking US and world news app. Then you're going to scroll up until you see the minimum version of Android. Since it's Android 5.0, it's good to go. It'll work for the older machines and the newer machines that are using Android 7.0 as well. Go ahead and click on the variant number and then you'll click on the download APK button. It'll take you to a different page and then it'll say that your download is starting. Now let's go ahead and download Fox News. Once again, make sure not to download anything that says Android TV. So we'll be downloading the fourth one down, version 3.39.0. When you scroll up, it looks like the minimum version is Android 6.0. So for those of you that have a newer treadmill that's running Android 7 or higher, this is the one that you want to download. For the rest of us that have a studio cycle that's running an Android 5 something or an older treadmill that is at Android 5.1.1, we'll have to look for a different version, one that will support us. For those of you that have Android 7.0 or higher, go ahead and click on the variant number and then download the APK. So I had to go all the way back to version 3.15.1. If we click on it, we'll see that it is good for us. It's good for Android 4.4 plus, meaning it will work for the studio cycles and the older treadmills. So let's go ahead and click on the variant number. And then we'll go ahead and download the APK. Once that finishes downloading, We'll go back to our desktop and then we'll look for the downloads folder. Go ahead and click on it and then we will start to install both of those APK files. Before I forget, let's go into settings and then into security. And you want to make sure that unknown sources is enabled. If it was not enabled and you had to turn it on, you'll get a warning. The warning will say that you're vulnerable to attacks, but not to worry. It's just there to protect you just in case you download and try installing something from an unknown source that you're not familiar with. But since we're using APK Pure and APK Mirror, we're good to go. Go ahead and click on OK and let's get back to the install. Go ahead and swipe up, hit the back button, and let's go back to the downloads folder. Okay, so from here, We'll go ahead and install the CNN. That's version 6.11.1. Go ahead and click on the APK. You'll get your typical install screen and you'll click the install button. This will take a little bit of time. It might even error on you, but let it run. I'll be right back once it's installed. So it's installed. We'll say done. And now let's install the Fox one. And for me, I'll be installing version 3.15.1 because I have the older Android version. Once again, install. 
and we'll be right back as soon as that's done. Alrighty, so the Fox News app is installed. Let's go ahead and say done. Let's swipe up. And as you can see, we have CNN and we have Fox News. Let's go ahead and click on CNN. It will ask you if you want the U.S. edition or the international edition. I'll pick the U.S. edition and then click next. And then you can pick any of these alerts. I'm not going to choose any of them at this point. I'm just going to check out the app. Click on done. Accept the terms. And here we go. We got CNN. I can watch specific news stories. I can scroll up and down. Or I can just go straight and watch live TV. If I click on the top right, I think I get a preview of live TV. Ah yes, it does give you a preview, but my preview expired because I actually tried doing this earlier on. So let me try signing in. And then you'll pick your cable provider. For me it's Verizon. And Hmm, it failed. All right, let me go ahead and uh, stop this and I'll be right back. All right, here we go. There are the two apps. Let's try it again. This is CNN. Ooh, I like that. So that's what it sounds like if I have good internet access. So I had to reboot my router. Oh, wow, this came up really fast, really fast. Let's see if it plays videos fast. The Biden foreign policy agenda will place America Very good. back at the head of the table. Quality is good. Working with our allies and our partners. As long as I'm president, we will always put America first. For years and years, we put other countries first. We now put them. All right. So now, oops. Did I close it by accident? This is CNN. No, that's, I have to give CNN credit. That's a pretty good opening screen. Very simplistic CNN logo and then just the words coming out. This is CNN. Pretty cool. All right. Now for the really cool. This is what I want. I want to be able to log in. So live TV. I wonder if I still have the preview. Yep. So I still have a free preview. I'm assuming that's why it's a small screen because it's just a the preview. Vast majority of the time. All right. In certain circumstances, quality is very good. Super spreaders, as they sing, as they cough, as they sneeze, can. It let's go back. Now let's go to that settings cog and TV login. Come on, let's make sure this works. All righty, this is good. Verizon. Ah. Oh. All right, so I need you guys to chime in. Comment below. Uh, I'm sure at least half of you are going to load the CNN application. Let me know if you can actually log in. Maybe if you have a an Android 7, it works better. I'm not sure. So the only thing that I could get to work, if we go back to the home screen, from here, we click on Watch TV. You actually can't watch TV after your preview is done, but what you can do is to click on some of these videos. You can click on some of the pertinent videos and then maybe watch those instead of live TV. Not the best, but at least you can watch some of the news clips. There are some episodes. Let me check to see if some of these episodes might work. Nah, okay. You'll have to sign in for that. And unfortunately, that just doesn't work on this app. If you have one of the newer treadmills and you somehow get this to work, Please comment down below and let us know. Let's try Fox News. So, oh, okay, so a little bit faster. Let's go ahead and try clicking on something. So it's just an article. I don't see any video here. 
All right, let's just go right to it. Watch TV. All right, that was quick. Once again, Verizon. And keeping fingers crossed. Oh, oh. That's a good thing. All right, hold on a second. I'll be right back. Ugh, did this not work? Oh. Been oh, wow, this worked. Been low. Kind of been all over Sweet. It looks like the Fox Disney app Studio does work. Canyon. And this was the older Fox app. Let me lower this volume. And in the middle of it is... Because what happened was... I'm running an Android 5.1.1, so I couldn't load the latest and greatest version. But if you can get if you can get CNN or Fox to work, then just put it down below, comment below, and said, "Hey, you got one of them to work." Anyway, the best of luck. This looks like it works. So I must say the uh, the quality is excellent. All right. It's very important. I think this will end up in the Supreme Court. And I think it's very important that we have nine justices. So I'm wondering if I can get closed captions. Oh, okay. This closed captions is an option here. So it looks like closed captions at the very least is an option on both apps. The thing President Trump says will end up in the Supreme Court. All right, then. So I guess I have to hit pause and then hit that arrow so that it doesn't keep playing and then okay so there you have it i've tried installing cnn and fox news they both installed no problem unfortunately cnn when you go to live tv doesn't work it does not allow me to log in with my cable provider so again comment below if you can get it to work and Fox News seems to work okay. Not a problem there. So if you lean to the right, Fox News. If you lean to the left, CNN. Try them both out. See what you think. Again, I am an equal opportunity YouTuber. And I believe that you should just keep your mind open. But I think it's really important that we vote in this upcoming election. Because many people complain. But if you don't vote, then you really shouldn't be complaining. And at the very least, I'm hoping that you're leaning towards the Nordic Trek iFit side of the house versus the Peloton side of the house. They're both great apps. Uh, they both get you to work out and provide you with motivation. I personally like the iFit series because they take you to all different faraway places and you have the luxury of traveling to these exotic places without leaving your house. It'd be nice if... We could be back to the pre-COVID days. Unfortunately, for the time being, this is the new norm. So I guess we should get used to it. And hopefully there will be a vaccine out shortly so that we can resume with whatever the new norm is. Okay, just waiting for this to pop back up and then we'll call it a day.